Hi. Yes. So it's the first time I'm giving this talk in English. I'm French, and I stuttered. Uh, so I know the accent will not be perfect. Sorry, but I hope you like this talk. First of all, who has ever heard about the imposter sy syndrome? Raise your hand. <laughs> yes, bye bye. Bye bye. No, <laughs> no joke. <laughs> ah, see. So I will ask you three questions. Raise your hand if you feel concerned. Are you sometimes afraid to ask stupid questions? Stupid? Yeah? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Do you feel comfortable speaking to junior but not to your peers? <laughs> and the last one, do you feel that, from, do you have the feeling that at any time you can be unmasked, that the other takes you for someone you are not an expert, a guru, a rock star, a ninja? Ah, oh, thank you. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, my name is Aurélie Wash. I'm Tevrel at of the Edge Cloud, a European cloud provider. I'm a CNCF ambassador, um, Docker captain, uh, Google developer, expert in cloud technology. Uh, Gitpod Hero. I'm uh, very invested in women in tech association. Uh, I'm a technical article book writer, sketch writer, speaker, and I'm um, an imposter. I'm here in front of you, but I don't know anything. I'm worth nothing. I don't feel legitimate. I'm not the most qualified person to, to do this talk. And I wonder if people find out I'm uh, quiche um, an imposter. Well, come on, stop it. I don't think I'm the only one thinking about that, and it's time to stop thinking this. Thinking this. Let's start with the beginning. What is imposter syndrome? It is, above all, a story of perception and comparison. I think that compared to others, I don't know much, while the reality is different. I know a lot of things that others don't know and vice versa. This phenomenon was first detected in women, but affect men equally and nearly 3% of leaders. It particularly affects developers and people working in technical jobs in IT. It manifests itself in the form of a small voice which tell us. Some people are convinced that they don't deserve their own success despite the effort 
they, they make to succeed, they often convince themselves that their success is, is not weighted to their work, to their personal fulfillment, but simply to the luck or the, the work of others. In fact, they live permanently with a feeling of deceit and they are constantly afraid that someone with will unmask them from one day to another. You know, this inner voice that maybe tells you that your work says, that you're not as good as others, that you have nothing to teach to others, this little inner voice is wrong. We will see some tips to fight the, this syndrome. Rule number one, knowledge is skills, wins you have. We are very good as humans to self coach ourselves, but much less to find qualities. You can start by listing your achievement, knowledge, skill learned so, so far. Think back to the day when you had a trouble debugging a problem and you have managed to find a solution. Maybe it was well, so much, but it's important to remember those times. To put them black and white, why not make a mind map? A mental map is like a list, but it, it makes both parts of your brain work. Convenient to make decisions and, in our case, to know where we are. There are no small ones. Our mistakes are there to allow us to be better and we learn through them. Rule number two, friends, peers, communities, you will find. Be well surrounded. Be part of a community where you can exchange and communicate. Personally, being a duchess has allowed me to feel surrounded and supported by other people. It allowed me to push back the limit that I set myself and to achieve things that I, that I never imagined, like being here in front of you. So, we are stronger together. You can't know everything, and that's okay. Learn from your peers, from a mentor, a role model. Rule number three, share and contribute, you can. Write article, cheat sheet in your personal blog, in a company blog, on a website, on a specialized ma magazine, this will allow you to deepen your knowledge and you will find that you know more than you think. Speak at the conference, give a talk. First, um, at work, 
then at a meetup, at a technical com conferences, you can go step by step to get started. You can transmit your passion to children during a coding for kids event by making intervention in high school, college, and to people in professional uh, retraining during coding cocktail, for, for example. These meetings are always very enriching for the others and for you. Contribute to open source project in GitHub, for a, a example. You can start by fixing the documentation, spelling mistakes, fixing bugs, and adding new features. There is no small con contribution. Or simply tweet what you just learned, even if you think everyone knew it before you. Who knew that? <laughs> Who knew that? One? <laughs> Bravo. Yes. Rule number four. Feedback. Rather than validation, you will ask. Ask for feedback. But avoid asking for external validation. There is a difference. Give also on topics you feel confident at first. Rule number five, peer programming, you would do. At, at two, se several, it allows you to improve your skills and those of your colleagues. For example, you can work on a new feature and you will learn from your colleague and your colleague will learn f f from you as well. Rule number six, trust in you, you will have. Don't try to copy others. Be yourself, stay yourself. Have confidence in yourself, in your ideas, in your abilities. For the little story in 2020, during the first lockdown, on a Saturday or a Sunday, just after eating, um, I was in my quiet bed. I took my old tablet and I wonder how I represent a pod. Mm, okay, well, so I draw pokeballs. Mm -hmm, okay, so for me, a pod is like a pokeball, and inside it, we can have one or more con containers. Okay, swanch, but okay. And I would have never imagined the next that people on um, Twitter love it. Love it. <laughs> Why? <laughs> uh, that my people love my way um, of uh, explaining complex um, technical things. And then, um, and that I will have a 
I would turn three uh, sketched books, created two uh, series of uh, video about Docker and Kubernetes um, on YouTube. And since August, I have um, created an illustrated book about Kubernetes, uh, which is in a paperback in Will <laughs> on um, Amazon. And I even gave a talk about um, Kubernetes without PC, without slides, <laughs> with Pokeballs, boxes, and, and just imagination, creativity, and with great uh, speakers who are uh, friends. And uh, if I wouldn't have um, listened to my imagination to draw uh, from Pokeballs, and, and uh, if I didn't uh, share on um, Twitter, none of this would have happened. So one um, of the messages uh, um, I want to share with you is trust yourself, try things, and share to others. Rule number seven, positive, you'll have to. Uh, rather than dwelling on uh, things you can do, on uh, negative feedbacks or comments you may have had at work or at um, technical uh, con con conferences, focus on the positive about what the incoming people around you are saying. I am going to tell you, yes, um, a little um, story. In uh, 2019, in a very, very big conference in uh, France, I had a comment that hurt me a lot. I uh, trom trom translated for you, so uh, we are at DevOps, sorry, but it's not uh, the right place for a speech therapy workshop. So I uh, created a talk I, uh, I worked uh, for four months and every night, but um, I had this um, comment. Yes, it um, hurt me a lot. And uh, during the one month, I said to, to myself, I am not a, a speaker. I can't be a speaker because uh, I, uh, I am a certain stutter. But in, in the end, I, um, I listen to my uh, colleagues, to my uh, nice people uh, um, around me that uh, tell me to con continue and spoiler alert. I uh, con continue. <laughs> Spoiler alert. <laughs> so, uh, yes, so being positive helps you move forward. Rule number eight accept yourself, you have to. An important topic. You can't be um, an expert in. Containers, Java, Rust, Go, JavaScript, uh, functional programming, serverless, CI, CD, garbage collector, 
nobody can. And you don't have to be perfect. No, nobody is. Do you find uh, yourself um, void in a particular skills? skills? Cool. Read on this uh, subject, deepen it, and invest a little time. And the, the little voice that tells you that you are bad will totally leave your head. You submitted a talk and you were not um, accepted. You did not have the job you hope for. It does not matter. Rejection is not a failure, and we, and we must um, accept it. I will tell you a second story. A few years ago, um, I wanted to do a, a, a master degree. It happened in two uh, stages. One. I got my, um, my um, diploma of advanced um, te technician. It's a BTS in a f f f French. So I was um, taken for, for the first step. Cool, you know? And then <laughs> I, um, I went to the in interview in a, 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 another city, and uh, I enter the room, and I see uh, eight people in the front of me. Eight people, wow, <laughs> so stressed. And yes, um, I was so stressed, and yes, I have uh, stuttered stutt 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 a lot. And um, um, at one point, one of the jury stopped me and uh, cut me off and said, you don't know how to speak. Okay. So it was a f f finish. And uh, yes, this uh, refusal um, hurt me a lot, but that did not stop me from doing a job I love every day. Since uh, 16, 17 years, without the precious master degree. So if you don't have the right degree from the right school, don't lim limit yourself to that. It is possible to get there. Yes, it's more difficult, but it's possible. And I um, always have a huge um, 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 admiration for um, people uh, in a prof professional uh, retraining. And I don't know if there are some HR in the world, but uh, don't focus in the white degree uh, because the, 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 the risk is being to miss great candidates and above all, great people all more motivated. And there is a quote from, from Nelson Mandela that um, um, I love. I never lose. I either win or learn. And that's true. We learn from our failure, our mistakes, and our experience. 
The imposter syndrome should not be a taboo subject. It is, it is important to talk about it, to transform this firm into strength. We feel alone, and it's false. We are not alone. And I promise that the most of the colleagues and the, and the speakers you love and you know, they suffer from this syndrome. So, so you have to accept what you feel, use it, and talk about it. And I was very um, happy to hear this uh, syndrome in an, um, an episode of Big Bang Theory TV show. It's so cool. Rule number nine, be proud of yourself, you have to. It took me uh, 36 years to uh, dare to say, to be able to say, I am proud of my, myself. And uh, still, it's uh, not um, easy, but it's very important to um, say it. You can be proud of yourself, and you should be proud of yourself. In um, our job, we tend to uh, be told when uh, we've done some, some, something stupid, when things are going badly, but not when the job is well done. So don't make the same mistake I did, and don't wait to say it. We are all different. We all have our own, own experience, and we can be, and we can be proud of what we have um, achieved. What this syndrome brings you is, above all, humility. This is a great quality for a um, developer and uh, people in a general. It doesn't matter if you don't know how to answer a question, but it's important to say it because other people are in the same situation as you and don't dare to do it. The imposter syndrome is not a fatality. Use it to improve and prove to yourself that you are good. You do not disappoint anyone, neither the others, and nor you. The imposter syndrome is a good thing. It can push you to surpass your, yourself, learn a new technology, teach to, to, to others, being a, a speaker, and in the end, suffering from this syndrome, re, re, reflect the, the fact that you are great people. So, Remember, stop, 
stop listening to the, the, the little voice or use it for a positive way because you are legitimate. Thank you very much. I like your feedback. Yeah. <laughs> still, well, still. <laughs> so don't uh, hesitate to give me and just uh, just uh, scan the QR code. Thank you. I don't know if I have time. Uh, but uh, people are um, angry, so. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, if anyone has questions, I can run the mic up over to you, so. The, Great. Oh. You have a few minutes. I have one that we were talking about earlier. Why do we need to talk about imposter syndrome so much in the tech field? Why is imposter syndrome such a problem in tech, in development? In um, tech, yeah. Because um, in a tech, uh, everything is uh, going um, quickly. Uh, there is a uh, very new um, technology every uh, hour. <laughs> and uh, we tend uh, to, um, and we, um, we, uh, ah, and we have the f feeling to, uh, that, 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 that we uh, should know uh, um, Everything, and in um, in a job um, a job of form, uh, every com com company wants the dev, sec, ops, uh, fin, <laughs> data, <laughs> and uh, so no, it's it's not possible to know and everything. And uh, um, another thing is uh, is uh, we. Uh, we compared to uh, uh, all other uh, people uh, every time. Stop to, to do it. We are all different and it's good. The, uh, the, the difference is a power. So stop it. <laughs> stop it. Voilà. Do you have any thoughts on how you measure your own improvement so, so you know that you're in the right direction? Sorry, I do not know. Well, you're far away. Yeah. I guess my question was, uh, <laughs> yes, do you have any guidance on how you track your own improvement so you know that you're moving in the right direction? Uh, uh, it's like, I mean, so you mentioned, uh, you had a lot of great nuggets there that uh, uh, have confidence, speak up in different events. I'm just wondering if there's some way that you 
can tell you so that you're in the right direction. Yeah, ah. I mean, this is how you should be proceeding. Right. Uh, ah. Talk uh, to, to your, uh, um, your cowing people because, uh, because we are very um, hard to, 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 to yourself, but the uh, nice people will always uh, see if you are going to the, to the right direction. So uh, don't, don't listen to you, <laughs> but uh, the uh, can, caring people. And, and if you want to uh, create a talk so to uh, teach to, 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 uh, um, to uh, oh, uh, deserve, do it. Do, uh, do the uh, things that, that, that you love, simply. Thank you. Thank you. We're, we're at time, so thank you so much for your talk. Um, will you be available outside to answer any other yeah. questions if people have them? Okay, thank you. Thank you.